Got a great unboxing today. We're going to be looking at the Anchor Solex C1000 Portable Power Station. This is the big daddy to the 522 that I reviewed earlier. So let's go ahead and unbox it and see what the difference is in the size and in the power that it provides. Okay, first of all, you can tell it comes in a bigger box that this thing is heavy duty. It's got these uh, foam on the top and I can see this big boy here. Let's see if I can pull it out. Right before you, holy cow, this thing is heavy. Whoa. Here, let me pull this out. Damn, this is, this thing weighs a ton. Holy moly. Right up from the front, you could see one, two, three, four, five, six different types of standard AC ports. You can power everything. This might be the solution that I want for backup power in the case of a power outage. You can have your modem, your router, your entire mesh network connected to this so that you don't lose Wi-Fi in a power outage. And it's got your car socket here on the front as well. This is something I also saw on the 522. Uh, LCD or screen here on the front. It's got some buttons. Let me, um, well, interesting. I'm going to have to do a full review of this. This is just the unboxing, but let me just go ahead and press this button and see if uh, I can get it to start up. In terms of powering it, I'm imagining that happens somewhere. Oh, here we go on the side. Let me just give you a close up. <laughs> see, this is a beast. I am very impressed at the size of it. Uh, it's got a reset button. It also has the port to charge it. And then also this, uh, 32 volt port on the side. Anyways, this thing is heavy. You can do a workout with this. Um, pretty impressive. This is the big daddy to the 522. If you're looking for a portable power station, if you're going camping or whatnot, in the great outdoors, maybe at the lake or up in the cottage, something worth checking out. I don't know what this retails for yet, but be sure to check out the full review when I put it through its text. 